This is the northeast of Brazil. It's a vast semi-arid area and the low erratic rainfall here makes it difficult to earn a living from the land. In fact, this area has the highest concentration of rural poverty in all of Latin America. For years, Ulysses dos Santos and his family struggled to grow anything outside their house. Irregular rainfall was not their only challenge. The soil here was also far too toxic. The cause? 1,000 litres of grey water ran outside every day. The water from the sewage, basin and shower was all thrown outside. We had open-air sewage with lots of flies. More than one million families in this area have a similar problem. Ulysses agreed to test out a new filtering system that could potentially change all of their lives. Now the family's grey water is piped into this biowater system. Here it runs through a filter. The filtered water is then clean enough to use for irrigation. The system was designed by Luis Montero Neto from the Dom Helder Camara project, supported by IFAD, the UN agency that works to alleviate poverty. He adapted the design from larger industrial models. It's not complex. It just needs a few elements of proportion in its installation, especially for the filter which consists of pebbles, grit, wood shavings and humus with earthworms. And this filtering system has been a great success. After the one-year trial period, the Dos Santos family now has a very productive vegetable garden and the produce has been tested to make sure it is free of toxins. The water that was jeopardizing our health before is now improving our health, as we are producing good quality food with it. Having access to fresh vegetables has also changed the family's diet. We didn't have these vegetables before. We used to eat mainly beans and rice and meat. But now we've added these vegetables and they're more healthy. They have more vitamins, more protein. We can see the results from this. Not only is Ulysses eating better, but he also has more money. Not long ago, this 28-year-old planned to migrate to the city to find a job. But now he has surplus food to sell and he has no intention of leaving. This is exactly the result that the project team hoped for. Young people have been wanting to leave the rural areas in search of work, but when an opportunity like this arrives in their community, they don't need to leave. We are working together with the farmers to show that it's possible to live well and live with dignity in the countryside. And now that the Dos Santos family are living well, and the biowater trial has been so successful, the project staff hope to get government support to install these biowater systems in one million homes across the region.